Hello people, welcome to my brand new Animal Jam channel and my first video. I planned on doing this video for a while now, so let's get right into it. For some who might not be familiar enough with the game or haven't heard, there's a very rare chest called an alpha chest in the game that anyone can currently obtain by digging through yellow shovels that are spreading around the world of Jama. So what is an alpha chest? An alpha chest is an item you can place in your den and open to obtain alpha items. An alpha item is an item with a unique ID. It also includes the number of times the kind of item has been found and its owner's username. I personally don't recommend opening an alpha chest because I don't like risking my chances to increase my worth in the game. An alpha chest can give an alpha item that's worth less than the chest itself, and mostly because I heard there's a glitch going on as for this time period when the alpha chest would only give out drone items when opened. But it can indeed actually give you an item that is worth more than the chest itself. Now what's an alpha chest worth? In terms of sapphires, the alpha chest is worth about 15,000 sapphires. At least from what I have heard, and I consider myself to be pretty updated regarding worth in the game, especially for the alpha chest. Please note that the worth in the game regarding to any item can change, and some of the info pass in this video would probably be more correct to the video's time period. As you can see in this video, I am running around with my wolverine and constantly teleporting to any map until I hear the sound of a yellow shovel playing. To hear this particular sound I recommend turning the background music of the game completely off. That's what I usually like to do because sometimes the constant switch between background music can give a headache and I want to be able to hear the shovels popping around properly. Now, when I find shovels, I sometimes dig down in a very specific way. I suggest for anyone looking for an alpha chest to follow the same patterns I use to dig down since this method helped me a lot, I have found three alpha chests and I feel safe enough to say this method has never let me down. Another thing you can see me not doing in this video is dig down fossils or regular chests. Why? It's because I simply have no interest of gaining fossils or regular chests but when I stumble upon a regular chest, I usually just cancel out the digging window, since an alpha chest and a regular one can't spawn in the same shovel, so it can only be one of them. Because I was digging down for quite some time, I recognized the differences between a regular chest and an alpha chest. So when you see rainbow colored diamonds around the chest, or a light purple lock on it, it means that it's a regular chest and I recommend you cancel the window as well, since you don't want to waste your time when in that time you can just find another rear shovel and get another chance to get an alpha chest. An alpha chest will have no diamonds around its icon and will always have a red crown gold lock in the middle of it. Another thing which I would like to mention is sometimes a shovel can spawn and disappear right when you get into a map. It happens, and if you can't find the shovel I recommend just switching to another map instantly. There will be times where a shovel can spawn in weird areas around the maps, especially in Serapia Forest. Sometimes a shovel will spawn inside bushes, that happens, it's okay, you can find them easily when you look inside the bushes, sometimes it's confusing because it's mixed up with the um, 
we forest icon but it's okay because you will recognize it and you can just click there if you feel like a shovel is spawned there that will be the end of this video i hope you find these tips helpful for you feel free to comment any other information you might find helpful for the topic of this video I recommend subscribing since there will be more explanation videos and more for me to talk about. Thank you people for watching and I hope to see you people in my next video. Have a wonderful time and goodbye.